Line Shea Bear 1000 here. As you can see, we're on the river. I'm gonna do a little fishing day. I don't know if we're gonna catch anything. Hopefully, we will. Sorry about the wind. Um, and the phone. Um, so, uh, we just got here. We went and checked out a couple other places. No good. You just, you know, so shallow and it just. So, we decided just to come here to our old spot. <laughs> Hopefully, we'll catch something. It's a little after two, I think. So, you know, not a great, great time to be out, but, you know. We should be able to get some hits, so stick around. I'll kick you back on, as Monkey said, when I catch something. <laughs> Hang tight. No, I didn't set the hook, I don't think. Oh, no. Damn it. Oh. It was a gar. I know it was a gar. Yeah. That's it why was... I told you don't reel in. It you, was a gar. You reel out. And he was big too. Dang. Okay guys, so update. I've been getting all kinds of hits. She hasn't had that many hits, but she had two fish. One fish was kind of small, probably just a couple pounder. It got off of her line. And then she had that probably 24, 28 inch gar just now. It broke her line, so that's the closest we got to catching anything. So, you know, like I was telling her, they, they you don't actually hook them. They, the, your line gets wrapped around their beak, really, and they got them teeth that come out the side, and they go like a, they'll cut your line real easy. So, but uh, yeah, they're hitting all right. So. Kick you back on in a minute. Yeah, I think I lost them. We'll do something. Losing? Yeah, I think so. Now I'm pulling. Yeah. And reel out. And pull. I got something biting on that right there. Holy shit. Ah. It's barely in the water. It's there. It's pulling. Oh my gosh. And we didn't bring the net, guys, so no, if I get something here, I'll have to take him around. Okay, we think Teddy Bear got himself a fish. I had two, kinda, and I lost them both. One took my line off, and the other one fell off. So, and he's, I think he's got this one. One was a gar that I saw, so that was pretty cool. Yeah, you had a gar on. Yeah, it was just too bad I couldn't get him in. It we wasn't super huge, but he'd probably go 24 to 28 inches. Yeah. I don't know what so. this is, but he's not like really fighting, fighting, but he's pulling. Could be a gar. He's yeah. kind of pulling like a gar. Yeah, they do that. Pulling against my drag. Huh. I don't know if what he's got here. And you might want to bring yours in because I'll probably have to go around that way. Damn it. You lose him? No. The turtle. What? Yeah. 
Aww, you call got me, a turtle. Call me the turtle man. Yeah, you're gonna always get the turtle. That's funny. There's lots of turtles in here. Anyways. Yeah. Hey. Hi, Sam. See the turtle? Oh, he's huge. Yeah. recording. You're good. All right, I'm going to jump down here. All right. So, okay, all right. You got it. You're in the screen. Like the way in. You want your scale? Oh, I can't. That that blue stringer in the top of that box. Yeah. Okay, bring it here. Do you need anything else? Not right at the moment. bigger than that one I caught. What, you mean at the other part? Yeah. Really? Well, that thing was more than 15 pounds right there. Oh, I know that other one is big. Okay, guys. Sorry it took so long to get my cameraman to do any cameramaning. <laughs> She's, but I gotta get my camera. But I'm the one catching the fish. Well, turtle in that case. No. Alright. I'm gonna put another hook on. Still got my bait, though. That's alright. You got something. Well, I guess it counts. I did have him in on shore, so. Yep. All right, be back with you. Update. <laughs> I had something on here. I don't know what it was, man, but I was fighting it and snapped my. Really? You need to tell the truth. All right, truth is, I was reeling it in. Not a fish on it. I was just reeling in. And it snapped. <laughs> it snapped all right. Yeah. I was just, all I was doing was reeling in to recast. Yeah. 
So we're thinking maybe, I, you know, I, I don't know for positive, but the only thing I can think of is that turtle, yeah. you know, cracked it and then I cast it a few more times and that probably made it worse and then I just reeled in and snapped. Lightning rod shock. Yeah, I'm shocked. It's a Berkeley. Wow. Are they good, mate? Yeah. Berkeley's expensive stuff. Well, decent stuff. I mean, it's not, you know. Right. But. Medium rod. Hmm. I'm just going to have to, I guess I'm going to have to get a, but geez, I mean, that's what these guys use for bass fishing and stuff. I don't, I don't understand it, but there it is, so, oh well. Can't fix it, huh? Can you weld it? Well, it's fiberglass. Well, fiberglass yeah. it together. Weld it. We'll get a kit. Okay. Oh, oh. You want me to buy a $40 kit to try to fiberglass this rod that I can buy for 20 bucks? No. I'm just kidding. Yeah, I can fix it, but it doesn't make sense to. No. I mean, if it broke, I don't want that. Well, even if it didn't, I don't, I don't, you know, I don't want to use this rod no more. At least, you know, I still got my reel. So we was talking, that's... Third rod and one reel is what I've lost. How many have I lost? Oh, none. Well, I didn't actually lose two of them. Two of them broke. This one and that one broke. Yeah. But the one I lost because of a fish because I was getting you bait. But it, yeah. I wasn't getting a bite. I mean, I just cast it in. You had it on your lap. And I reached down. Well, I had it under my arm like this. It yeah. yanked it out of my arm. Yeah. And I went to reach to get her, because we was in the boat, to get her a piece of shrimp. Gone. I mean, it was just like somebody just yanked it out of my arms. It was we gone. Took off with it, so we figured it was a very big fish. Well, it had to be a big yeah. fish. Because turtles are slow. This yeah. thing just took off, grabbed it, and went. We didn't even have time to try to get it, really. No, I mean, it was gone. It was just like I said, someone yanked it out of my hand. Or I had it under, under my arm. Yeah. Like this. Tight, too, because, you know, we're, we're in the Gulf of Mexico, so. Yeah. Big fish out there, right? <laughs> and it did. It, yanked, it hurt. So, all right, guys. Uh, I think I do have one or two on this camera, on my body camera. I caught a little fish. This is the third one. You need a stronger one. This is the third one. This is the third pole. Oh, I thought we bought you that. Huh? We bought you that one? Yeah, and we bought that. These two were bought brand new. Huh. Remember the one that broke in Crystal River? Yeah, you got that one, right? Or did you get the orange one? I don't remember. Yeah, I got a little red, red belly. Monkey had one on, but it got off. I can't get her to set the hook. She just waits and just starts reeling. She won't set that hook. I don't know. So anyway, I'll keep you updated. Okay, he got guys. snagged. So Shaber got a another... Turtle number three. Isn't he cute? Oh, he's so cute. Aww. Hi, turtle. Oh, he's cute. Gotta get him off of here. And he broke his other fishing hole. Come on, I think what happened, it cracked. But the other 
big turtle that he has. Done. I'm gonna call him the turtle man. Don't call me that. <laughs> <laughs> Keep telling her, don't call me turtle man. Oh, he's so cute. <sighs> I'm over here trying to get something. <laughs> I'm gonna get him off here. He he got snagged somehow. Hey, hey, get out, get out, get it's out. It's a baby, he doesn't know. There he goes. Well, put him down. <laughs> I gotta get this turtle. Okay, guys, so that was pretty much our fishing trip. <laughs> uh, yeah, so. <laughs> oh well, I'm still gonna upload because you know everybody just only uploads when they catch stuff, but you know you can't catch something every time. I mean, we caught some things, but uh, yeah, that, that's pretty much it. I wish I'd have been rolling when that rod broke. I might have been because remember, I sat here, I was recording for a while and didn't even know it. Yeah. I just happened to look down and my light was red blinking and I was like, shit. Here. I'm recording. Are you really? I'm sitting here recording jack shit. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> yeah, so, yeah, so we're going to go. As you can see, it's getting later. What time is it, Mama? <laughs> That's at night. 7.42. Oh, 7.42. Two. Time to go home and get something to eat. <laughs> we won't be eating fish tonight. No. <laughs> yeah. Maybe we'll... It costs me money every time I go fishing. Well, us money, not just me or two. Yeah. It costs us money every time. I'm, I'm buying rods, reels, tackle oh and then what 20 minutes ago i went to make my last cast i cast and snap the line snapped for no reason the line just snapped the monkey didn't want to film She's like, well, I want to get my camera. I'm like, look, it's my thing. <laughs> monkey wants a new boat, don't you, Monkey? Yeah. She yeah. wants an upgrade on the boat because she wants to go a little farther out in the ocean. We don't go out in the ocean. Well, the Gulf. Not out, out. Not, but... the, not the ocean, but the Gulf. Yeah. There's a lot of cool fish. Something a little more stable. Well, we've had our boat in the Gulf. She's worried about me pulling that rope, yeah. lifting the motor up. I do worry. But I don't want to sell that boat. I love that boat. You move on to a newer, bigger, and better, and then you'll say, "Oh, I love this boat." Yeah, but that that boat can sit out back and not eat a thing. Because sure. it's a boat, you're going to have problems. Of course. So. If we have, let's say, a water pump issue, and I order a water pump, you want to go fishing, boating, see, we'll still have the old rich line sitting there. See what I'm saying? There's a lot of times we could have used two boats. Well, we had two boats at one time. Yeah, we did. We've had three since we've been together. Yeah. The other one was a fixer up there. I mean, it ran. It just it needed interior. Yeah. But we needed the money, so we sold it. Yeah. So we're looking for another one about that size. Looking for around an 18 foot. Something like that. Yeah, yeah just upgrade I mean, so we can. Florida, that's what to do. But we don't want something too big to go in here. No. 
I mean, it's a river. You can take bigger boats in here, but we like to get back in them channels. So even if we get something that we can't really take back, she wants a regular boat, maybe a center console or something, but something that, you know, that's what I'm saying. If we want to go back into them coves and stuff, we can always bring the, our boat, the little boat out. I don't know, we'll see. Uh, I'm just kind of kicking it around, looking, seeing what's out there yeah. right now, but you never know, something might pop up for us. So. never know, it's like our living one day. Good deals, around six grand. Yeah. You get some pretty good deals on some older boats, 80s. Mm -hmm. um, but we're talking Mako, and, you know, boats like that. All right, guys. Well, thanks for watching. I appreciate it. Shea Bear, the Myth of Man Legend. Gone for now. We're going to pick up our stuff. And I'm going to throw this fishing rod into the trash can up here. <laughs> I got to thinking that's the fourth. You don't want to take it home? That's the fourth rod. I got to thinking about that. Because the one, the rod didn't break. The eyes broke on it. And you can get eyes and, you know, the loops that you can replace them. I think that's what I was going to do with that one. It's got um, my Zebco on it. But Alright guys, again, thanks for watching. Appreciate it. Got the weekend coming up, so y'all enjoy and be safe. We'll see you in the next one. Bye bye guys and take care. Monkey took her stuff up to the truck. <laughs> she won't know I caught this until after she sees the video. <laughs> <sighs> Four fish and three turtles.